Hey you guys, today I'm here to do Jump Start January. This is day two of it. Um, I don't know what I'm going to title on besides Jump Start January. Um, we just going to talk about random things every day. We just going to talk about something random. Um, so, today I want to, you know, first start this video off by sending my prayers and condolences to Tasha Thomas' um, family. Um, she was the girlfriend of, um, John Crawford, you know, the guy that got killed by the police in, um, the Walmart. Um, apparently she was in a car accident, um, was it yesterday afternoon? And so, you know, my thoughts and prayers are with the family of, um, Tasha Thomas. It, that's sad. Just to die on, on New Year's. You know, you finally, you excited that you made it to New Year's and then to die on New Year's and your family had to deal with that. It, it's sad. And then, like, a couple of months after your boyfriend or, um, do, um, die, it's just sad. So, yeah, my thoughts and prayers are with her family. Um, also, oh my God. So, apparently, thanks, who would think, I was going to say, damn Thanksgiving. New Year's Eve, um, my sister said, you know, I posted my sister was going out to celebrate New Year's Eve that night or whatever. And when she got to her friend house in Compton, she noticed that the police had taped over, um, an uh, area over there. So, come to find out, um, uh, it's so many stories going on. First, they said that a lady had... A little girl had went home and told her mom that she had been raped. And the mom found out what the dude was. And he, um, well, she went to the McDonald's and she shot the dude. And when she shot the dude and walked out of McDonald's, by then the police was called. And, um, they shot her five times. So, oh, these kids. Anyway, I'm keep going. The kid might come up here crying. Just know that. Um, so they said the police shot her five times or whatever. And I'm like, oh my God. Like, uh, just imagine your child come to you and say you raped somebody. New Year's Eve. And you go kill this motherfucker. Because that's something probably I would do. I couldn't have blamed her for that. And then you walk out because you was protecting your child. And then you get, um, shot five times. Day before New Year's. Hold on. Somebody said come here. Let me just stop them. Before y'all be knowing every damn thing. Too much of everything. Don't tell them what they be talking about. Whatever. So, anyway. um, if She saw I'm doing the video. She knew to turn around. So, anyway. Then we get a, the story of the same story. But somebody else brought it out that they were her and her... It was a girl and her boyfriend arguing, and he hit her, and she went to the car, and she got a gun, and she came back, and she shot him. She only shot him one time, and then when she went outside, then the police shot her. But I was just like, all this going down like this to start off the new year? Really? So then me and my sister was going today, and we were going to um, L.A., so we going down along by the freeway. We noticed that the Channel 7 News van was by, like, this overpass where you could look down and see the train. So I'm like, damn, what happened over there? Because, you know, where they were parked at, nothing's over there. So I'm like, what the hell did the news safe station be over there? Come to find out somebody had got shot at the Artesia station, which is in Compton. But it's a, um the train station platform and they found a body over there and i'm like oh my god it's the second of the fucking year why are people doing this stupid shit like we gotta pray y'all like it's just it's only the second day of the damn year and it's so much going on i told y'all it be, it be just it's just it's bad it's just bad but what would you do if your child came to you and said hey somebody raped me would you go and retaliate or would you call the police and then wait for the police to retaliate? I don't know. Me, with my daughter, and I only have one? 
I think I would have retaliated. I'm sorry. But then to retaliate and then the daughter lose her mom the day before New Year's. That's sad. If that's the story. Then even if it's the story that y'all get into it in McDonald's as a boyfriend and girlfriend and he hits you and you go back and get a gun. Like, damn, was it worth it? And then I'm sitting there like, dude, was it worth hitting her? Did you know you had a crazy girlfriend? Like, it's crazy. Um, but that's all I got. I didn't want, I don't want to make this video too long because I feel like I got a lot more days to go. Um, I'm leaving California tomorrow afternoon. I'll be back in Vegas tomorrow night. My birthday is on, um, January the 9th on Friday. I don't have anything planned this year of all the years that I, I'm usually the one that really celebrates my birthday. I want to do stuff for my birthday. I like to go eat. I love to go eat for my birthday. Um, I like going to the movies. But this year, I have nothing, like, not nothing planned this year. I don't too many, too much have a lot of friends in Vegas, so. It's just gonna be me and my kids to get some babe. So, I guess that's what we're gonna be doing, a family day at home. Um, for my birthday. Um, which is not a problem. I'm just used to, because I don't do, I don't. I don't take the time out for me for no other holiday, not Mother's Day, not none of that. I just only celebrate my birthday. So for this year, not to have nothing planned, it's like a shock. Um, but whatever. I guess the older you get, you just be blessed to be alive. Um, I really want, I hope Ashley turn up for her birthday so one of us damn team Capricorns can turn up for our birthday. Even though I know she in a lot of pain, but hell, 70% better is... It's better than no percent better so i hope she have a nice time on her birthday um and then the i heard the um d miss nine birthday is january 6th so happy early birthday to you i hope you have fun too get some something um then my boo james Cowell birthday is the same day as mine so one of us better turn up on january 9th you me i don't know but one of us better have a nice damn time that's all i can say that our day can't be going out like that. I'm just saying, not starting 2015. But that's all I got. Um, we're going to do it every day this month. Jump start. Um, January. Day two. Um, some days, I'm telling y'all now. Let me give y'all a fair damn warning since it's only the second day. Someday y'all going to see me come in here with my hair wrapped up. Me not dressed. Um, I ain't got time to be trying to be all that. Not, mm -mm, not, not that many days straight. Some days, some might be late. Videos might be up late. Some days, they might be up early. But I will do them every day. Um, and make sure you check out my, you know, my YouTube family. You know, Mike B, Ashley, C. Mentis, Squeaky Jones. Just put up a new video. Um, Candy from Sweet Addictions, Forest Rocks, Much Love. Sayshawn Bradley, you know, um... I'm going to keep on. I got a lot more days, so I got a lot more YouTubers to shout out. All right, you guys, follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Google+, Xbox Live. Um, I do everything by the ghetto view, T-H-A, not T-H-E, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace out.